morning, Calvert Hall. I'm Jack Saleem. I'm Cameron Harris. Today is Tuesday, October 25th, 24th, a day five on your schedule. Please stand for the prayer and the pledge. Let us remember that we are in the holy presence of God. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, amen. Jesus, you are the great questioner. Keep our questions alive so that we may always be seekers rather than settlers. Guide us on our way and give us courage on this journey unfinished. Amen. St. John Baptiste de La Salle, pray for us. Live Jesus in our hearts forever. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Please remain standing for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. General, medications. No medications other than EpiPens and inhalers can be self-carried by students. It is not permissible to carry any prescription medications or over-the-counters such as ibuprofen on school property. All medications must be stored in the health suite. Please see the nurse if you have any questions. College visits. The following colleges are visiting in the counseling office today. Christopher Newport University, 850, first period, and Virginia Commonwealth University, 1235, sixth period. Chapel and prayer drop-in is today just after dismissal. Is there something on your heart you want to share with God? Want to give him a bit more space in your life? Today is Ms. Budarazzi. Next week is Mr. DeBricky. Early dismissal. Students, please report to the attendance office in the morning to get an early dismissal note before you go to homeroom. You need to give that note to your teacher before you are dismissed. Clubs, chess club. Chess club will meet today from three to four in LaSalle Center. ASA club meeting. ASA will meet today at 3 p.m. in the activity center, George Young Hall. Look forward to seeing you there. Fellowship of Christian Athletes. FCA will meet Thursday morning at 7.30 in room 108. All are welcome to attend. It's academic. The It's Academic team has an early dismissal at 2.15 p.m. today. Congratulations, cybersecurity teams, for completing the Cyber Patriot competitions over the weekend. Team 16, 1140, finished third out of 120 teams in Maryland, placing them in the top 2% of nearly 3,000 teams nationally. Three other teams had excellent finishes for the first round of the season. Instrumental music. Congrats to the competition marching band on an incredible performance at the Mid-Atlantic Showcase, winning their group, more impressively, achieving the second highest score of the entire show with an 89.4, only behind a group three times our size. Thanks to everyone who came out to support. And now a spe special message from the Crokinole Club. Uh, Crokinole is a Canadian tabletop game. Think of it as a combination of uh, curling without the ice and shuffleboard. Two people or four people take turns flicking wooden discs on the smooth surface. Um, the center hole is 20 points. The next ring is 15, 10, and 5. Uh, and you basically go back and forth trying to knock off each other's discs to score as many points as possible. Like, it's just a, it's just a cool game to catch on with. Like, easy to catch on. And, like, people here are really just, like, really cool, to be honest. There's not really – no negative energy. All is positive. All for the competition until it's not. And then it gets real competition, but – Everybody's so cool. Uh, I would recommend Crokinole Club to my friends because it's something very easy, very casual to get into. It's new to everybody. Um, it's also a game that people don't uh, know pretty much at all. So uh, I think it's really it's really good to get people out here because once they get involved in the game, they don't stop. You know, it's very addictive. It's very people get hooked on it really quickly. So uh, it's just a fun time. It's a great atmosphere, and come show out. You know, it's very fun. Thanks, Crokinole Club. Sophomores, Sophomore Leadership Institute. There is a Sophomore Leadership Institute event tomorrow, Wednesday, October 25th at 6 p.m. in the Activity Center. Dinner will be provided as we watch the movie Dunkirk. If you are in the Sophomore Leadership Institute, please check your emails for more info and to register. Space is limited. Juniors, ring representatives. If you do not bring your ring to the representatives before homeroom, please stop by the dining hall ASAP or on your way to your first period to have issues resolved with your ring. Homeroom tomorrow. Juniors will meet in the theater for homeroom tomorrow morning. Book bags are permitted. Seniors, plaza photo. 
Seniors will gather in the plaza tomorrow, October 25th, during homeroom for the senior photo. Seniors will go to homeroom as normal and then be dismissed after the bulletin. This is the only day the senior photo will be taken. Athletics. Wrestling. On Thursday, October 26th, there will be sign-ups for anyone planning on wrestling this season. Sign-ups will take place at 3 p.m. in the wrestling room in Crispino Center. Indoor track and field interest meeting. There will be an indoor track and field interest meeting this week on Thursday, October 26th at the track by the high, high jump mat at 3.20 p.m. If you are unable to attend, please email Coach Baker, bakers at calverthall.com. So there's sports schedule. Varsity soccer versus Curly, 6 o'clock home. JV soccer at Curly, 3.30 away, early dismissal at 2. Cross country versus Mount St. Joe, 4 o'clock home at Goucher, early dismissal at 2.30. Water polo at Mount St. Joe, varsity 3.30, JV 4.30 away at CCBC. Early dismissal for varsity is 1.30 and for JV is 2.30. That's all for us today, Calvert Hall. Have a great day. As always, use the remaining time at homeroom to check your email.